All right, it's me again, bright and early, 6 a.m. Again, I'm not a financial advisor. I just found this very, very interesting here in the Fed, or in the uh, the registry. Uh, please like, sub, hit the bell. Uh, these are things that are pretty important, and I'm just going to highlight the key points. Okay. Now, this is a proposed rule change. This is not final. Um, they're they still have 52 days in order to go ahead and submit comments, um, and then after that, there's 60 days after they come to a conclusion that it would take effect so i i do want to state that there is some time here however it's always better to be ahead of the game in my opinion um all right so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna dive right in <clears throat> so basically um i should probably start down here actually all right so this goes down to the utilities of the financial market Okay, basically, it, it comes down to whoever manages, operates a multilateral system for the purpose of transferring, clearing, or settling pay, uh, payments, securities, or other financial transactions among financial institutions or between financial institutions and a person. Um, FMUs provide essential infrastructure to clear and settle payments and other financial transactions. Financial institutions, including banking organizations, participate in FMUs. Uh, pursuant to common set of rules and procedures, uh, technical infrastructure, and risk management framework. Now, I want to talk about uh, the framework in, in risk management, though. Okay. If a systematic, um, if a systematically important FMU fails to perform as expected or fails to effectively measure, monitor, or manage its risks, it could pose significant risks to the participants. We've already seen that. Um, and the financial system more broadly. We've already seen that. Uh, for example, the um, inability of an FMU to complete settlement on time, <clears throat> I'm sure that we could all relate, uh, could create credit or liquidity problems for its participants or other FMUs, and um, an FMU, therefore, should have an appropriate and robust risk management framework including appropriate policies and procedures to measure, monitor, and manage the range of risks that arise um, or are borne by the FMU. It talks about the Dodd-Frank uh, the, the Dodd Act as well. Um, let's see here. Operational risk management. I mean, they just go deep into risk management here. Okay. Um it seems like they're going ahead and they're trying to go ahead and, like, the Fed is trying to push the blame off of them as much as possible. Um, if you've noticed throughout the last two years, give or take, um, a lot of these rules that they're dropping kind of separates them from taking the heat from what I believe could be um, upcoming. But... This is very, very, um, this is very, very telling that they're talking about like risk management nonstop. Um, the previous video that I did, uh, please go take a look at that. I mean, you don't even have to watch the whole thing. You could watch the first, you know, fifteen minutes. Uh, they talk about um, the credit default swaps. Remember, credit default swaps on Credit Suisse was record highs, uh, even above the two thousand eight rates. And that was when I saw the Bloomberg terminal um, the other day. But I'm liking the fact, and I'll show you right here. Look at, all right, so this is from the Fed. Now look at all the things from the SEC. We're getting some things from the president. Some things are relevant, some things are not. I think only like one thing was relevant. And then I only saw one that wasn't. But most of them are SEC filings. Um from the beginning well probably like the fifth give or take on sec sec like they're it's like they're trying to get their ducks in a row for something i mean maybe that's just my conspiracy brain you know working but i just don't believe in coincidences you know um again please like sub hit the bell and um i will catch you guys i'm sure at any at any point in time I am going to restart the stream here in a little bit. Um, it's just SEO reasons. But nonetheless, I will catch you soon, fam.